Children, you're all very much familiar with addition and subtraction which we've learnt in the previous years. Now, let us learn more in addition and subtraction. Now, we're going to see addition. Now, let us see an example for addition. Now, four vendors went to a coconut grove to buy a coconut. To buy coconuts. Each one needed 700 coconuts. Now, we'll help them to select the coconuts. Now, the first vendor selected 350 coconuts. Then he went again to find 320 coconuts. Then again 30 coconuts. So with the help of these three, he formed 700 coconuts. Now the second vendor, he went and took 400 coconuts first. Then he took 300 coconuts. With this 400 and 300, he formed 700 coconuts together. Now, we are going to form 700 coconuts by picking out the remaining numbers. Now, the third vendor, I would say he picked up 450 coconuts and 250 coconuts to form these 700 coconuts. Now, the fourth vendor would, they have the remaining left for him for the fourth vendor. So it would be 310 plus 75 plus 315. So if you count these three, it will form to 700. Now, write the missing numbers in the magic squares for the given total. If you sum up these three, you must get the number 45. 8 plus 3 is 11, 11 plus 4 is 15. So, you get a 45 here. In the same way, if you add these three numbers also, you will get 45. These three numbers also, you will get a 45. In the same way, we are going to find the total for 210. Now, 80 plus 30 makes 110. 110 plus what number gives you 210? 110 plus 100 gives you a 210. In the same way, 110 plus 60 gives you 170. 170 plus 40 gives you a 210. In the same way, we are going to find the total for 165. 65 plus 50 gives you 80. Now 80 plus what number gives you 165? 80 plus 85 gives you, if you total this up, you will get up 165. In the same way, if you add these three, you will get 165. So what numbers will you have here to get 165? You can add a 25 here and a 45 here to get up 165. Now we will fill in the boxes. 0 plus 1 is equal to 1. So 0 added to any number will be the number itself. So 1 added to 0 also will be 1. 2 added to 0 also will be the number itself. 0 added to 2 will be the number itself. 2 plus 4 is 6. 4 plus 2 also is 6. 0 plus 0 is 0. 0 plus 3 is 3. 0 added to any number will be the number itself. Now here, 4 plus 5 is equal to 9. So 5 plus 4 is also equal to 9. Even if you change the order of the numbers, the sum will be the 9. You see the addition 4 plus 5 is equal to 9. Even if you add a 5 plus 4, it is also equal to 9. Even if you change the order of the numbers also, the sum will be the same. Now 5 plus 3 is equal to 8. 3 plus 5 also is equal to 8. The number, the orders have been changed, but the sum up 
will be the same 8. 2 plus 6 is equal to 8. 6 plus 2 will also end up in 8 if you add it. You are changing the order of the numbers but the answer remains the same. 7 plus 2 is equal to 9. So 2 plus 7 also will be equal to 9 only.